Welcome back. You're watching Our City. Now, the Cape Town Science Centre is a not-for-profit educational facility in Cape Town. It forms part of a wide range of non-classroom initiatives to improve children's understanding of science and science literacy by stimulating curiosity and developing inquiring minds. We visited the centre to check out their winter holiday programme. Let's take a look. The Cape Town Science Centre is an NGO and basically we are there to inspire young kids or older kids, depending on where you want to go, to being creative and thinking out the box and actually experiencing science in a whole different way. Science is no longer in a book, it's actually found all around us. And the Science Centre helps you actually discover that. So during this holiday, um, we are doing surviving the ice age. So instead of your kids ledging around at home, just sitting around looking at movies the whole time, they can come to this Cape Town Science Center and see a whole fun range of activities. We have workshops that extend from exploding volcanoes all the way to discovering how ice is formed and how, weather, um, how the icy weather goes. And we also have cool dino hunts and excavating dinosaurs, so saving them from the ice. And there's a whole range of fun activities for them to be able to do. Every day we have got science shows, camera obscura tours, and the exhibit floor that is filled with puzzles, as well as exhibits that will get your brain thinking a little bit more. Um, and actually challenge you to think out the box and have fun while doing it. It's suitable for the whole family and it's definitely something that the whole family can enjoy of quality time together. So the Cape Town Science Centre is actually open every day of the year except for Christmas and New Year's. So we have programs running throughout the year. During the term, we have curriculum-based programs for schools. During the weekends, we actually have weekend programs um, directed to the whole public and for the holidays as you can see with this holiday we have special programs running so we'll have the surviving the ice age this year um, last time we had biotechnology and we also had a whole range of things with ice, um, summer science when we did it for during the summer so going from one thing to the next but every holiday we do have something that's jam-packed and fun for all the kids to be able to enjoy. We provide for kids of all ages, no matter how young at heart you are, so from the ages of three upwards, they can, they're all paying, um, up to 95, a little older than that as well. We've got some really cool people that come in that we can learn from, so if you're young at heart, the Science Centre is definitely there for you. If you're looking for something just to do for the holidays, the Science Centre is even better there for you. Um, there are some quiet areas if a person would like to get, um, just in our SKA exhibits or enjoying the stuff at the I Cafe with a lovely cup of hot chocolate or cappuccino. We've got of the best cappuccinos around. So it is a space for all ages. For the high school kids, which is very important, is they are required to do certain experiments for the curriculum. And what the Science Centre does is we actually have the equipment, we go out to schools to be able to do those um, experiments with them. So for instance, one of them is esters, where the kids, well, the kids, the grade 11s and 12s, have to mix chemicals together to identify certain smells. And it's something that's required by the department that all grade 11s have to actually do and we get a chance to be able to get that for them. So for this holiday we've got a winter camp that's happening and that's where kids from underprivileged schools are actually coming in and joining in. So it's our asset program, they're coming in for winter school doing a lot of workshops that are required that they might have struggled through during the term and it gives them space to come and spend a week with us while doing that with facilitation and extra stuff that goes in with it. And then in the third week of this term, we act, this holiday, we have got a winter camp happening where we've got at this moment over 40 kids coming through to spend a week with us in the mornings doing different experiments, doing different activities throughout the morning without their parents being involved, which I think for them is very excited. They're very excited so far, the kids that I've spoken to. I uh, just came here because we went to the art museum, so now we're coming here just because I love science. Oh, you love science? Oh, okay, and what did you see and what did you like the most? Uh, I like this place because there was a building center and I, I loved the most was the bottle rocket. Oh, okay. And so basically when you grow up, you want to be a scientist? 
Mm, something like that. Maybe inventor or engineer. Oh, okay. Tell me about what do you know about that? Mm. What is that? It's where you it's where you you invent stuff and then you also get to be a bit included in the building. Okay. <laughs> wow, that's nice. That's very smart. Thank you so much. You're welcome.